Well, firefighters across western Washington had a busy morning with major fires in Seattle, Lakewood, also in Olympia. That one here burned through a city block, destroying businesses and a five-story apartment complex that was under construction. King 5's Drew Mickelson standing by there for us, but we're going to take you up over the scene for a better look at some of the uh, smoldering remains of that fire, where you can see here what's left of it, the damage from this morning's fire. Uh, you can see what it caused there, still smoke rising from that building. Several people lost everything. And Drew, I know you spoke with a longtime business owner. Yeah, it's been a, been a rough day here for sure, and, and it's turning into a rough night as well. I mean, the 911 calls started coming in here at 5 in the morning here and 5 in the evening. It's still smoking. Fire crews are still out here. Power crews are working to restore power as well. Downtown is, Olympia has been experiencing a homeless crisis. The pandemic put businesses out of business, but this intersection had promise, one with a bright future until today. Before sunrise, a rising fireball awakened Olympians. I got up and saw a lot of light flickering on my wall. I can feel the heat from a block and a half away. By the time firefighters arrived, the still being built five-story apartment complex could not be saved. All the windows were exploding. There were, it, I mean, it sounded like there were a bunch of explosives. Crews instead focused on protecting neighboring structures. A man and his teenage son escaped from their apartment next door, but at least three of the neighboring buildings are likely total losses. A coffee shop with a motorcycle repair shop in the back and Pete Lee's automotive were the hardest hit. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Pete Lee's father opened up the garage 50 years ago. He fears the building and the 15 cars that were inside are all gone. Devastating for all of us, heartbroken. A legacy is gone. Heartbreaking is is a perfect description. It's, it's an, as well as grieving. Olympia Mayor Cheryl Selby says the city was looking forward to the 44 new apartments that would have been part of the market flats seen here in a picture taken last month. The city needed the new housing and what that would have brought downtown. It's a step back for sure. I love this place. I grew up down here. Pete Lee has been critical of the homeless and the crime surrounding his business's longtime neighborhood. And now this. I probably will relocate, not downtown Olympia. No, I've had enough of it down here. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms are in assisting Olympia fire investigators trying to determine a cause of this fire. At this point, nothing has been ruled out. I did speak with a man who lived in the apartment right next door. He says he woke up to the flames and some explosions. He got his son out of there. They left with only the clothes in their back, his son was still in his pajamas. Live in Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.